This place is great, really comfortable. I'm just going to get settled in. Time to move on, get on with my life. Yes, absolutely. said it was a long time ago let it go seriously Things had gone from fine to fucked up in about a second, and now there were two idiots at the wheel. Clear. You got the floor? Sure. Right. Look after yourself, bro. Stay safe. It wasn't my own safety I was concerned about, trophy wife or not. I'd said I would protect the girl. I hoped I hadn't lost my edge, along with everything else. It was time to choose, a nasty fall or a bullet to the head. lady, only this time she wasn't calling for more liquor in her cocktail. She was out on one of the balconies, and I hoped, not about to be thrown off it. Don't be stupid! Don't be stupid! Let her go! Let her go! Come on! It might have been stupidity, drunkenness, or maybe both. But before I knew it, I was back taking insane risks, trying to save fallen women. Tranquila! Tranquila! Nós cuidamos disso! Nice work! Now you need a hand? No, you? Where the hell's Rodrigo? I don't know, man. Thanks. Somebody's gotta go find him. Está tudo sob controle agora. Fica tranquilo. Imagine the elevator doors opening to a firing squad of muzzles. As far as I could see it, the one thing my plan had going was that no one else would be stupid enough to pull this move. Where's Bronco? I say so. I had to move.
It looked like they were taking him out through the basement. Maybe I still had a shot. Rodrigo was too rich a prize for them to throw away. Sure, I'd have to work hard to get him back, but I knew the bad guys would want the boss alive almost as much as I did. was on the wall to the left of the gate. being famous as well as rich as the bad guys know who to kidnap. Another parking lot rattling with gunfire. Was I too late? Cala a boca, cuzão! Continua dando multas. Não põe o nariz onde não é chamado. Vamos! Ajuda, cara. Chama o homem. Você diz que é bom, Max. Você diz que é bom. Não se olhe tão bom. Ei, o que poderia ser melhor, hein? Os bons homens reunidos e os comandos sombra estão mortos. Sim. Então, quem é esse cara? Eu não sei. Algum tipo de cara. Algum tipo de cara. Different branch of the police, not UFE, but uh, normal cops. I don't know about this stuff, politics. Everywhere politics. Shit, Max, you look kind of beat up. Let's get this lot home and then I'll, I'll get you home too. Come on. A couple of days later, it was back to work, ferrying the boss's broad and his dipshit of a brother out for the night so they could recover from their brush with mortality. Then again, what did I expect? These were the kind of people who went to nightclubs in helicopters.
seen it coming, but that was no surprise. It's hard to keep your eye on the ball through the bottom of a glass. I just hoped I could get to Fabiana and Giovanna in time. The doors had been chained shut. I didn't need my Portuguese for Beginners phrase book to work out what was going on. The guy making the noise was the boss. He was sending them around to cut me off from the other side. And sure enough, a few seconds later, I had some company on the dance floor. Another way out through the VIP lounge. Rich fools love a private exit. two cents. This crew was starting to look a lot like friends of the gate crashers at last week's party. These guys had some real issues with the Broncos. Fabiana left on a one-way flight. I knew this was going to be a bad idea, but in the continued absence of any good ones, I decided to go with it. What a view. I guess my time in Sao Paulo wasn't quite the paid I shot at by a class of psychopath. These guys weren't messing around. This place was like Baghdad with G-strings. A couple of more seconds that I'd have given some poor street cleaner a crappy start to his day. Now, I had a ride to catch. All I said! Come on, come on! Jesus, Max, I can't 
can't leave you alone for five minutes. I needed to 